Hello everyone! Welcome to another Lyceum Math Club video tutorial. In this video, we are going to talk about mean and variance of discrete random variables. But before we proceed, here are the objectives. To illustrate the mean and variance of a discrete random variable. To calculate the mean and variance of a discrete random variable. To interpret the mean and variance of a discrete random variable and to solve problems involving the mean and variance of a discrete random variable. Mean values are also known as expected values. The mean of a discrete random variable x is a weighted average of the possible values that the random variable can take. This represents the average value we expect to cure before collecting any data. They are the central location of a random variable. In this formula here, the small letter x represents values of the random variable of the capital letter x. dx represents the corresponding probability and this symbol represents the sum of all products. Here we use this symbol for the mean because it is a parameter. It represents the mean of a population. Jeffree Star is a basketball player who regularly shoots sets of two free throws. Suppose that each shot has a probability of 0.6 of being made and the results of the shot are independent. The table below displays the probability distribution of x. First is the number of shots which is 0 and 0 0.16 so 0 times 0 0.16 equals 0 and that is the mean value next is 1 and 0 0.48 so 1 times 0 0.48 equals 0 0.48 next is 2 and 0 0.36 and 2 times 0 0.36 equals 0 0.72 so if we add 0 plus 0 0.48 plus 0 0.72, you will get 1.2. Next, we are going to talk about the variance. Variance is denoted by sigma squared. It displays the variabilities or the dispersions of the random variables. With variance, we can see how far apart a random variable is from its mean. And this is the formula of variance. Here, x represents values of the random variable, sigma squared represents a variance of a random variable, mu is the mean value or expected value, and p of x is the probability of a random variable. Now, we are going to use the same example from the mean. Earlier, we arrived with the answer mean is equals to 1.2. Here we just added another column for x squared where x is the number of shots which becomes 0, 1, and 4 and another column for x squared multiplied by p of x. So 0 times 0 0.16 is equals to 0. 1 times 0 0.48 is equals to 0 0.48 and 4 times 0 0.36 is equals to 1.44. Next is we're going to find the sum. So 0 plus 0 0.48 plus 1.44 is equals to 1.92. To get the variance, we are going to use the formula and substitute the values. So variance is equals to 1.92, which is the sum that we got from earlier, minus 1.2 squared, which is the mean. Variance is equals to 1.92 minus 1.44. Then subtract, the variance is 0 0.48. And that is all for today's video of mean and variance of discrete random variables. Please don't forget to follow our social media accounts. Thank you!